Oh my gosh. Well, I feel like the Austin comedy community is so discerning and so smart and so ahead of the ahead of it that. Um, Listen, if it does well here tonight, I think that bodes very well for the movie in general. Because this crowd is just... I, I've done a bunch of live shows in Austin, and they're just... It's a different comedy crowd. Better. <laughs> oh, man. I, 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 uh, the best professional experience of my life, is that fair to say? It was amazing. I uh, the, admired these people and it was just an inc unbelievable experience and so much fun. I just felt so supported and I had a blast. I wish I could give you a juicier answer except that it was the best time of my life. <laughs> So what I love about her performance that I'm so excited for people to see is the approach to it is so honest and truthful, which of course, because she's in, you know, because she's Charlize Theron and has played every, you know, amazing dramatic role that we've seen. And, but, but her approach is so truthful and honest that then the comedy ends up playing even harder. So I, I think people are going to be like stunned to see her instincts and how funny she is in the movie. She's hilarious. Uh, oh my gosh, I'm scared to admit this. My first crush was on John Ritter from Three's Company. The first time I remember watching something and being like, oh, what's this? Yeah, I thought he was hilarious and adorable. Listen, I like funny guys.